Hello there. I believe you are blessed wherever you are. All right. Be blessed. I say blessed week and blessed a life to all, everyone, all over the world, regardless of the color of the skin. I know we are still facing this AC. We are still others. They are still under the siege of this demon of Corona. Remember, I said it will disappear. I didn't want to talk too much when people, they were prophesying Corona this, Corona this tomorrow. I said, I don't want to talk. God said it will disappear. It is our sins. We created this. It's only God's mercy will uh, make it to disappear, not any treatment. We are seeing other countries, they've forgotten about co Corona. They are running, focusing in their politics. I say pray, kneel down and pray. Right, let me go uh, straight to the point. When I was kneeling in the morning, God said to me, I must tell uh, Africa, special Sadak region. I know that Sadak will end. I know uh, Sadak will end soon. There will be no Sadak. There will be many Sadak. But God said to me, there are two countries that will be raised from the edges that will come a basket of other uh, uh, nations. I will repeat again. There are two countries that will be raised from the ashes, meaning they are still in the ashes right now. There are two countries that will be raised from the ashes in Sadak region that will attract a lot of investors and attract a lot of uh, people to flock uh, and become a, a, a basket, a food basket of many tribes and uh, many nations. Those countries, they are in ashes. From now going to 2030, there will be two giants. That's what God put. He said two giants. There will be two giants. He will create two giants, especially in this uh, Sadak region. So let us pray. Let us pray. I don't want to say which country and which country, but I'm, saying the, I'm speaking the mind of God here. There are two countries that God will raise from ashes. They are going to be giants of Africa. They are going to be giant of Africa and the basket, food basket for many uh, uh, people and tribes, regardless of the color of the skin. So we pray, we pray, we pray. When God says uh, some, something, we need, now, uh, need to kneel down and pray, not to question God, because God is the one who knows our tomorrow. I said from now to 2030, which is few years, God is saying you will raise two giants. I'm saying, be, let us pray, especially those who are in Sadak region. You pray. Remember when God he does that, a lot of people, they are going to be saved. God is saying it's already uh, uh, happening on the ashes. Two giants will be raised. So I'm saying you pray. Maybe it is your country. Kneel down and pray. Remember, God is merciful. He's the one who can turn dust to gold. And he's the one who can uh, turn anything that is useless useless to become useful i say remember jesus loves you so do i may god bless you thank you he was there waiting patiently in life he was there I found that answer.